What is up guys? I'm not sure where I'm picking this camera up at, but we are in Florida and I'm outside. You can hear the frogs croaking. Just listen. You hear that? That is the sound of frogs croaking. So what we are doing right now is trying to catch some of those frogs. I literally was just out here and already saw maybe five or six frogs um, and I haven't even stepped far off of the property. There are a lot of frogs. I've seen some I seen some invasive Cuban tree frogs out here, some green tree frogs, I saw a leopard frog, and a couple of other different types of frogs. I'm also on the hunt for the elusive cane toad. And as you can see, the frogs are gonna love it out here. It's hot, and based off the fogginess on my camera, it's very humid. It is extremely humid out here. There's also a large pond that is directly behind me. So this area quite literally screams frog. Um, so along with that, there is alligators we're gonna have to watch out for. Um, and snakes and things like that. So we're just gonna keep an eye out, do a quick little herping uh, session, I guess you could say. Hopefully, hopefully we can catch some things. I'm basically just gonna catch the frog, show it to you guys on the camera, and then release it because I don't have a bucket or anything to capture it, um, unless it's something super duper cool. But let's go see what we can't find. Right off the bat, I caught this guy earlier. We have this beautiful green tree frog. Look at that fellow there. Hold on. Look at that guy. That is one of many. So that is find number one. Now we're going to go out this way here. Now we're going to go out this way here and see what else there is. I've got my trusty dusty headlamp on. We don't want to step on any snakes or dog poop. Um, look, right there. Right there. Do y'all see that? Hold on. See if we can approach him without scaring him too much. Another green tree frog. These guys are everywhere. And wow, that thing is gorgeous. Look at that fellow. And he is living his true, true best life. So that is fine, number two. We're not gonna catch him. We're gonna leave this guy sitting on the fence post. Um, but let's continue the hunt. Now, I'm not sure if you can see, but every now and then you can see the glistening of frog eyes. So this whole area is just filled with frogs. Oh boy, here we go. Okay, I just stepped down. There goes another frog. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? It looks like a leopard frog, maybe? Looks like there's a leopard frog. Uh, I don't know where he went. Oh, no. Look right there, guys. Y'all see that? Right there. Another frog. Let's see if we can catch this fellow here. This guy's a little bit bigger. We're going to turn the flashlight on, and we're going to turn our headlamp on here. All right, there he is. We're going to kind of come up from behind him and snatch him. Oh, where'd he go? Where'd he go? Oh. He's gone. Here he goes, here we go. Let's see if we can catch him. Three, two, got him, got him. There we go, look at that guy. Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. Yeah. Look at that leopard frog. You can see where they get the name leopard frog from those beautiful leopard spots. Super cool find, and there's a ton of these guys out here. All right, we gotta be careful, because right here is a large pond, and there are alligators. Um, in this pond and we don't want anything to happen so we're just going to release this frog right back to where he came from go ahead go free there he goes he's off he's off into the water i will say the insects are terrible out here the amount of insects there are here's another frog by the way let's see can we get the light on him look at that little guy right there looks like some sort of spring peeper or something i'm not too sure what that guy is but he is tiny look at how little he is look at how little he is he's so little and he's so calm look at how little and calm he is super cool find holy crap look at that massive cuban tree frog right there we're gonna try to catch that big fellow that thing is huge all right here we go we're gonna try to catch him with my with my bad hand boom got him got him he's peeing he's peeing everywhere uh oh he's down here all right, make sure there's no snakes. We're good. All right, I got him. Holy crap. Look at that frog that I just caught, guys. Oh my goodness. This has got to be one of the largest tree frogs I have ever seen. And also one of the most adorable. Hi. Hi, these guys are eating good out here. So these frogs are, of course, going to snack on all sorts of different things like the insects that are sticking all over me right now. What a massive massive frog you are such a cool find hi buddy hi beautiful beautiful ginormous cuban tree frog you can see that thing to my hands 
He's also puffed up right now to make himself look bigger than he actually is. But man, okay. All right, we're gonna go ahead and get ready to release this guy. Super cool find. Let's see what else there is. All right, we're gonna put you right back on your spot. There, there you go, buddy. There you go, and he's off. I will say this right now, as much as I love catching frogs in the dark, the amount of flies and small insects that are sticking to me because of my light is insane. I can, I'm like literally inhaling insects as we speak, but it's okay, it's okay. It's, it's really for the love of frogs. But as you can see what the sign says, notice, keep out of pond, gators, snakes, etc. Look what else I see, you see that right there? I've got at least two more frogs right now that I can see, maybe three. Let's get a closer look. Let's see, what do we have? Make sure no gator, no gator by the edge. Okay, cool. Let's see here. Okay, another leopard frog. That guy right there is another leopard frog. There he goes, we're not gonna mess with him too much. But look at the amount. Guys, look at that big old leopard frog. Let's see if we can catch him here. Nope. Dang, these guys are going everywhere. Got him, got him, got him. There we go. Another, oh, he's over here. He's going. No, he went into the pond. I lost him. Oh my goodness. Do you see that right there? The camera may not pick it up too well, but those little dots are alligator eyes. Those are alligator eyes, guys. That is an American alligator sitting out there watching us. Let's see, I don't know if you guys can see it. Right, uh, let's see if we can turn the light off here. Right there, you can kind of see the dot. That is alligator eyes. Super interesting, uh, but let's continue. Let's continue. All right, look at what I just happened to stumble upon. Two more leopard frogs. These guys are absolutely everywhere. Such cool and colorful frogs. But look, let's see if we can get this guy to kind of hop away a little bit. Oh, he's gonna be still for us. Hey, hey, oh, he's gone. Let's try this one here. Hey, buddy. Hey, come here. So if you approach these frogs slowly and you don't apply too much pressure, they're not too apt to jump. But look at that guy. Look at him, he's just sitting there, hanging out with us. Hi, there he goes. Okay, now he knows he wants to get away and he's gonna get away. And guess what, another leopard frog over here. These frogs are absolutely thriving in this pond. Oh boy, here's another behemoth of a leopard frog. Let's see if we can approach this guy without him jumping too much. Hi. Hi. Okay, he's letting us pick him up. Oh, there he goes. He's over here, and he's off. And guess what? Another leopard frog. I swear I'm not picking up the same frog over and over again. These are different frogs, different places, different times. These frogs are just everywhere. Super cool. Go free. There he goes. Although I will say it looks like our, gray, looks like our green tree frog friend is still hanging out here on the fence. Bye, buddy. Bye. Well, look what we found here. Another huge Cuban tree frog. Now, the Cuban tree frog is invasive to Florida, um, but they are super cool frogs to see out here, none the least. Hey, buddy, come here. Oh, there he goes. All right, we'll let him go and do his thing. 